gentleman the missile specter puts it en route to the east coast, we will lose the White House. We've rebuilt it before. We'll rebuild it again. Casualties? Possibly 30 to 50,000. Depends on the exact location of the detonation. All systems will go down. General Shepard, you warned us. We should have listened. When they speak of this moment, we will not be the ones who stood guard while America died. One man is responsible for all this. Makarov must be brought to light. Whatever you need, General. We've got a blank check. Uh, okay, so, like... Does everyone think that Makarov just launched a missile at the uh, U.S.? A nuclear missile? And they're already counting the casualties and whatnot. Like, oh no, like they have no idea that Price did it. Oh. I'm getting some deja vu here. Give me a mag, holy. All right, I'll kill those guys over there. This totally isn't fucking with the alternate alternate timeline. Oh, I've got like such a restricted visibility here. <laughs> Come in, Sat One. This is ISS Control. Houston's requesting a feed from your helmet cam. Over. Uh, they want you to look over towards the dark side of the Earth. Should be cresting the horizon about 15 degrees east of the starboard PV rays. There it is. We're getting your feet, Sat One. Come in, Houston. Uh, are you getting this? Copy that, ISS. Video feed from Sat One is clear. Sat One, keep tracking the bogey. We're looking into it. Stand by. Houston, we're not scheduled for any satellite launches today, are we? ISS Houston, stand by. We may have a problem here. Houston, this is ISS Control. Um, any word on the... Nope. Oh, poor guy. It was for a good cause. Who pushed me out? Okay, so Price did this on purpose. That's a fact. I don't know if he knew he was launching a nuclear missile at us. But for sure it worked out because there's a huge EMP and all electronics went down. So maybe like he launched what he knew was the EMP missile and we just thought it was a nuclear missile or something. Also, suddenly I magically have eight mags. Lol. Uh, lol. <laughs> what the hell was that? Something falling from the sky, Corporal. Yeah, I'm going out there too, bitch. No balls. No balls. Come on. Is that the moon? I noticed that like two episodes ago. Yeah, what a spectacle. Damn it. All right. We gotta regroup with whoever's left out there. Corporal Dunn, take point. Star! Star! Or we will fire on you! I don't remember the damn countersign, all right? I'm just 
just a runner. Don't shoot! The proper response is Texas, soldier. What do you got? Colonel Marshall's assembling a task force at Whiskey Hotel. You guys need to keep heading north. The countersign, by the way, is Texas. Tell everyone else. Get to Whiskey Hotel. Go! You heard the man. Let's go. I can still aim without the red dot sight, it's fine. Ooh, what's this though? And I can aim even better with the good old fashioned iron sight. Do it. Can you fuck off? Apparently I can't aim with the iron sight. You know what they should have done? They should have also uh, made your major crosshair go away for this mission. Yeah, I mean, it's fine. What are you talking about? Oh, yeah, we sure will. Just hold my beer. Hang on. I thought Ghana was spelled with one N. Don't tell me to keep quiet, bitch. Kill you. Y'all are wasting way too much ammo. What about them? I got our six. Go. It's clear. I don't know what's worse, man. Dodging falling helicopters or freezing my ass in this monsoon. <laughs> Quiet. I think I see something. Where? Care to give me a oh. <laughs> I think freezing would be worse, although they're both equally probably painless. I mean, from what I've read, freezing isn't painful, it's just really uncomfortable. And yes, I've had frostbite before, so shut up. Is there a guy right here? Oh. Street clear. We're Oscar Mike. Let's 
<laughs> Burger Town. Watch for movement. Move up. Feet dry. Whoa. Cut the chatter. Ramirez, take point. Is that me? That's me. So get out of my way. I'm I'm Ramirez. Get out of my way. I'm taking point. Get out of my way. Whoa, check out the seal on this door. I thought the president's bunker was under the west wing. No, that's just for tourists. This must be the real thing. Open it up. Real or not, man, this place is history. Hope they got out in time. 